Oh, somebody decided to take my son to Pennsville. What? They trying to go everywhere is where I'm been. And then there's a Glenside Ave. Trust me. You can't only say you've been living on this road or this road and say, oh yeah, I lived on that road, but what town did you live in? Because obviously you didn't live in Duffer on Glenside Drive. That's a Glenside Avenue. That's a Woodland, Wood, um, Linwood Drive, not Glenwood Avenue and, Ma and Maple Shade. You live in everywhere else, but, so you better be stupid. Don't be so stupid. So meanwhile, I'm going to go grab my son. Because somebody decided to take him down there for my Mark's birthday. I got to go to the store. My son decided to have pork chops for dinner. So I have to go to the store and get pork chops. In. So anyway, all right, let me get some stuff done. Well, I'm sitting here trying to talk. I'm going to get I put a couple things away. I did not wash my, because I don't dump oil, I don't dump oil in my sink, so I normally, I drain most of it, and then I let it sit, and then I scrape it and put it in my, I didn't do my dish, my breakfast dishes yet, and probably my, I bet you my father-in-law is going to come over and sneak over here while I'm gone, I know it most likely because he always comes over my house when I'm not here he's not supposed to but he does he's probably and he's probably the one that comes in my house oh slap the kids do you know that for a fact just like uh Piper Piper says well do you think you think your husband comes home uh, comes home from work at lunch no but my father-in-law likes to come in my house and start shit and move my stuff around. So that's nothing new. So I will go to the store and get stuff for my son for his birthday dinner. And I want to pick up cake mix too, cause I like I like the cupcakes. Oh. I like the cupcakes. <sighs> uh, anyway, so praise be to God, Hallelujah. Truth be told, may justice be served. I guess they didn't think I knew where where these this this was. Because I know the back way in, so stupid, you're retarded if you think you're going to get away. You got my kid going everywhere else, so far away. And I know everybody's stupid game, but that's all right. I'll be there. Excuse me. I'll get there, no problem. I used to work down in that area. My friend, my best friends live down there, and her, their family. So I know people down there too, you know. And you know who else used to live down there? Um, Beth. No, not Beth. Was it Beth? Beth. She now lives in Newfield. Everybody that there's a couple people I worked with at Newton Tool that live here in New in in town. As a matter of fact, um. <laughs> the girl who handles the bonds of the town, it w worked at Newton Tool. She was, oh, it was a hot job, hot job, hot job. We got to get this hot job out for Newton Tool. And she's the one that handled it. I'll remember her name in a little bit. But it's a hot job, all right. It sure is. Well, she's the one that handles the financing part of the township. Bondness. Let's pay, let's steal this bond for this money. Let's do this. It's, it's one of those bond schemes that I was studying on uh, fraud, the white collar shit in this goddamn town. So, it's only a matter of time. It's only a matter of time. Before you die. Would you stop accusing us? Well, that's just.
just uh, seems like it because I, I just uh, um, seems like the pattern because oh we got to get a bond I got a bond for this I get a bond for this oh let's get a bond for that yeah okay we'll see a bond what kind of bond you get again how much money people think I'm so stupid and, and then and then they think they're not going to get away with it. Oh my God, it's it's ridiculous watching watching the corruption. You're sick in the head. Well, if only the people really they're so blind to to crap. It's funny. Everybody's so blind. It's stupid. Uh, I'm gonna download this. Finish getting ready and and get out of here and I'll see y'all when I get back. I'm telling you, I am so sick and tired of, I'm sorry, some of the cops around here covering up for these people that are coming in my house illegally. They're sneaky, backstabbing, stupid bitches. Cowardly bitches who can't give me my subpoenas to my face. Can't give me my complaints to my face because they know they're wrong and they're going to go to jail for it. They can't give me your Oh, she's harassing me on Facebook. We're dubbing her. Yep, you go Mom. right ahead. You do that. Mom, what did you say the first time? Because the world's going to know because I have the originals here. And once I'm able to get in a courtroom, okay, the judge is going to look at all my, my original videos that I did. Mom. What? My son lives in his pajamas. He can't stand being and if he could go to school in his pajamas, he probably would. But yeah, I, I will. But you can't. So all right, yeah. praise God. I, I gotta get ready in to my go. Pajamas because in the summer I because in the summer I don't wear anything else because yeah they come home, even when they I remember because, I, I have videos on Facebook. They, 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 they would come home, have their clothes off. From from the, as soon as they walk in the door, from the door all the way to the to the couch, and then changed already into the like Mark. He always wears his underwear and, and t-shirt, tank top, undershirt. So he'll come in, take all his clothes off, and that's how he is. And Brandon, he takes his clothes off and puts his pajama pants on usually. Yeah, I don't my head. Know wait, wait. Said Maxwell. What's it? What's that? S M H. Maxwell himself. I said Maxwell himself, as my son said. It's not shaking my head. It said Maxwell himself. Say that again. What's SMH? Said Maxwell himself. <laughs> All right. Praise key, God. I, I can't do that. Hallelujah. All right. Praise God. Truth be told, and I will see us all when I get back. All right. And, uh. Somebody's got to speak up and stop covering for everybody. You know, oh, I'm tired. I'm sorry, I can't do this no more. I'm sorry, I can't. Here's her checkbook. You better believe it. It's my checkbook. You better give me back that checkbook. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. <laughs>